I kind of like this area because it's a bit weird. It's not the same as the neighboring flats. Prior to the renovation, the windows were covered in frosted films. The kitchen was cramped. Rooms were underutilized. Bedrooms were small. Nothing was aesthetically pleasing. When we moved in, uh, we realized that this area is actually um, very odd. We realised that it looks plain, so we went with a gallery wall that could maybe uplift our mood and probably inspire us. I come across this picture of a green sofa in a living room and I was so into it, I needed to have it. That's how everything started. Everything had to revolve around the green sofa. You can see around here, like we do put a lot of plants and wooden stuff, rattan, so all these will flow throughout the house. I wanted to keep the bathroom pretty simple, so I have subway tiles for the walls because I really want the floor to stand out. We also have a gold fitting because we wanted to keep it consistent throughout the rest of the house. Initially, this was two separate bedrooms. I hacked the rooms so that I can create more space to create this amazing wardrobe. With the added space, we actually get to build this area here to add in our nice sofa that we found. Um, this is where we can actually uh, relax and read a book. But let's be real, I actually just toss my clean laundry here and I don't keep it for a week. the kitchen because of the long counter space here I can do a lot of meal prepping. My favorite thing about the kitchen cabinet is its drawer because it has an inner drawer. Mm -hmm. 